Good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome, welcome to the almighty Truck Rudy Show here from the house coming to you today. Yeah, guess what? We're getting ready to do our usual, <laughs> have breakfast. Yeah, that's right. What now? No garbage bags. No garbage bags? Oh, well, we'll just have to throw it in the trash. <laughs> Anyways, I guess we're running out of stuff. But we're not running out of eggs just quite yet. We're getting ready to have us an awesome breakfast. And then we got our cooler over there already. Look at that. We're getting ready to pack everything up and uh, go camping. Yes, indeed, we are. So let's have us a good breakfast and then pack everything up and hit the road, go camping. Oh, I'm so excited. Well guys, it's been a busy, crazy morning so far. Yeah, it really has been. I've been uh, preparing to get all of this stuff in here. A lot of that the wife prepared, but uh, some of it I did. Yeah, most of it probably the wife did, but I did some shopping. I uh, went and got Got some stuff anyways, and uh, set up that guy's phone. Yeah. He finally got a phone, eh? Well, yeah, well, you know, an actual phone that he can use. Before he had like a cheap phone, but it was just, it, didn't, it wasn't connected to a line. So now he can actually make phone calls. So let's get in the car and hit the road, guys. We want to go camping, right? Who's yeah. excited? Hopefully no takes. Hopefully Ooh. no takes. I hate them. Yeah, look at that. That guy is hiding over there. <laughs> Anyways, let's hit the road, guys. Well, it is time to go to camp, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to a different site this weekend than we did last weekend. Nonetheless, it's going to be a lake somewhere. Yes, indeed. We're going to Nudemig Lake this weekend. Last weekend we were at Dorothy Lake, although we will probably make a little bit of a pit stop there at my dad's place there at Dorothy Lake. Just go visit him for a couple of minutes and chat with him for a little bit and then we'll go over to uh, Nudemig Lake, but uh, yeah, here we go on our way. It looks kind of cloudy today, but it is, uh, it is nice and warm. It is right now 26 degrees Celsius. So it's probably going to be quite humid and hot today, which that's okay. I'm fine by that. But anyways, here we go. Off to the lake. All the work is done with chopping and getting everything ready and packing the van up. Oh man, that was a lot of work. <laughs> Running around and had to fix my uh, sandals yet and had to get some super glue and do all that. Everything takes a, uh, more time than you expect usually. So now we are on our way. I'm happy, happy, happy. It's nice and warm. Yeah, super nice, super, super nice. I'm very, very happy. And Diego, I think, is happy that he got his new phone. Yeah. Oh, so, yeah. First time he's actually had one that's under a contract. Now he can actually make phone calls and text, whatever, go on the internet, hopefully watch some Trucker Rudy videos, <laughs> he can download YouTube on it, whatever, right? I haven't even done that yet. <laughs> yeah, I know, yeah, he'll probably download a bunch of apps on it now, and oh, text yeah. his uh, girlfriend, and yeah. <laughs> now he's getting all red in the face. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. We're just having fun. Anyways, let's go to camp, guys. We decided to make us a little bit of a pit stop. Let's see. It says warning over there. I don't know if you guys can even see it, but we'll zoom in on it. It says warning. <laughs> yeah, no parking behind. The dam. Yeah, so you guys are probably wondering where are we, right? Well, we're over here at uh, Seven Sisters uh, Hydro Dam. 
I don't know, I know we've shown you guys before, but it's been a while, so I figured, you know what? We have quite a few new subscribers, right? Why not show? Yeah, it's been at least two years probably since uh, we've shown you guys this place, so why not go in there and show you guys again, right? All right, guys, this is what it says. Please keep out, otherwise you may drown. But we just saw a big, big eagle up there. I see him. He landed over there, it looks like. Is it not? Did he not yeah, land yeah. over there? Yeah. There. Right. It looks like him, yeah. yeah. Let me see if I can possibly zoom in on him a little bit. Yep, yeah, I can. Definitely can zoom in on him a little bit. There he is. That is a huge brown eagle. Unfortunately, I'm too far away to really get a good shot of him. But uh, that is kind of what we came here to see. But that tree is in a way... I can't really show you guys too much. Well, I found a different spot to go over here and show you guys a little bit. This is a huge, huge hydro dam up here where uh, they make hydro, of course, right? As you guys can see right there, it says Seven Sisters. It was built in 1949 from the looks of things. And it is super, super windy up here today. But the water level is not really that high as you guys can see. I've been here where there's been a heck of a lot more water up here. All right, guys, there's a couple of beavers up here. You guys see them? Right there. There's a beaver right there. You guys see it? He's trying to sneak over the rock there. He's trying to hide. Let's see. I see him. You guys see him? Right there. There's a couple of beavers right there. Let me see if I can find them. Well, they're hiding from me. Oh, oh, yeah, they're definitely hiding from me. They're underneath there somewhere now. But yeah, let me see if I can zoom in on that bald eagle right now. He's, or not bald eagle, there's a brownish eagle. I don't know how good it's going to turn out on the video itself. Because I'm as zoomed in as far as I, I can. And I can't get any closer to him, but anyways. This is the waterfall up here, and I've seen it where water with this whole thing was completely filled with water. Oh, there's another one coming up there flying. Let me see if I can capture him on video. There he is. Yeah, right there. There's another one coming right there. I can't see him anymore. Oh, there he comes. Yeah, there he is. Right there he is. That must be the partner for that other one. Yep, there he is. Landing right there. Oh man. I see somebody over there though. There's a car. You see that over there? They might be keeping an eye on us here. I don't know what they're trying to do. But we'll get out of here anyways. I know it's really super, super windy up here. But figured I'd show you guys anyways. Are you guys ready? To so look straight down. Yeah, look at that, guys. That is a long way down there. Oh, that really is. Now you can kind of oversee the whole area up here. That's where they got a few dams up there. Yeah. Yep. I already got that one. But yeah, this is the uh, Seven Sisters. I see a big bridge way up there yet. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it, but yeah, yeah, you guys should be able to see that right there. Yeah, that's a long way that I can zoom in with this thing, right? So, yeah. <laughs> I did see a couple of boats uh, behind there as well. But yeah, we finally went up on this uh, ramp. And then when you look around onto this side, you're pretty much water level over here, right? But anyways, let's go for a little walk. They have life jackets or... Uh, uh, what do you... Life ring. Life ring right there, just in case you fall in. Which we don't have any plans of doing that, right? Yeah, look at this, guys. We found this another angle that we can really show you guys around a little bit. Yeah, you guys see how the water is coming out right there? <laughs> yeah, that's kind of interesting. I guess the, all the uh, boards are not completely sealed, right? So you guys can probably see there is like 
like huge cement barriers probably is whatever that is and uh, so yeah that's how they let the water get out if it gets too high right and Diego said there's big turbines in here eh? I don't know if we're gonna be able to see it oh you can sort of kind of I guess see it in there yeah you can actually see in there wow look at that that's where the hydro turbine turbines are but anyways we better get out of here it's really really windy well guys i just managed to find me something more interesting look at that i've been trying to take pictures of those birds for a good long while what does he have on the snouts right there almost looks like he's got something on there can't quite 100 percent see but yeah i might get my camera out it's super windy oh now they're flying away <laughs> i guess they got spooked by something well they're gonna go for a little swim it looks like yeah it is super super windy up here but yeah that looks really really neat this is as far as i can zoom in man i wonder how they can sustain against that strong current right there but i guess they can look at that <laughs> wow they got huge wings don't they yeah those are huge wings look at that they're trying to hide from me <laughs> that's what it is well look at here guys on what i just discovered Look at that, there's a duck with babies right there. You guys see that? Isn't that cool or what? Right here by the waterfall. That is so sweet, man. He just kicked his little one right there. He's like, what's going on? Let me see if I can get a few pictures of him. Just leaving the Seven Sisters Hydro Dam. Yeah, it's time to go to my dad's place for a few minutes and then uh, Go over to my buddy's place yeah yeah we spent some time here but it was definitely worth it we got to see a duck with a couple of chicks that was really really neat we got a couple of pictures of it we'll see later how good they turn out but yeah look peter pretty neat in my opinion I don't know it still looks kind of weird with the clouds but whatever well I made it to my dad's place you guys might recognize this place look at that we had our tent set up right over there right so yeah this is uh, at my dad's place like I told you guys we were gonna make a little bit of a pit stop you might recognize this yeah look at that we made it yes indeed we did we uh, had a little bit of yerba. I don't want to forget my hat over here, though. Yeah, I don't want to forget. Don't want to forget my hat over here. So we're getting ready to leave again. Yeah, Ronnie says he's finally on his way. So I guess we'll uh, grab our equipment and uh, and then we'll uh, go over to his site and then uh, do some barbecuing over there in a little bit. So. Let's go over there. Well, we are on our way to Ronnie's place, guys. Yeah, he apparently is finally on his way. So we're uh, gonna try and make our way down there as well. To his site. He's a long way away yet, but I'm sure he's giving her. <laughs> I'm sure he's giving her. Let's see if we see the bold eagles up here today. They had a nest down here, down the road right here. I walked up to it the other day through the bush and I found it. Well, they did not like that too much, but I walked up there and let's see if I see him today. Let's see, I don't see him just yet. I don't know where they're hiding, but we'll see if we can find him. Nothing yet. Anyways. Let's go over to uh, Ronnie's place and then uh, we'll have a good uh, good supper there tonight. Looks like Ronnie has finally showed up. I know, right? I know, we've been busy here setting everything up. I want to say hi, Mr. Ronnie. Hi. How you doing, Mr. Ronnie? I'm very good. Very good. What about you, Mr. Nico? Good. You doing pretty good? Yeah. Hey, this is the superstar here on my video now, eh? Mm -hmm. Hey? Yeah? You like Trucker Rudy show, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you want to tell him a story? Huh? What? You finished school this year? No, one more week. One more week? 
You want to pass your grades? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Oh, that's good. So, let's show everybody what we got going on here. Yeah, we set up our tarp over there already. We got the barbecue grill going. I think Ronnie is going to be lazy today. I'm going to be cooking, right? Mm -hmm. I think so too. I totally agree. Me too. Huh? Me too. What do you agree to? That Ronnie could be lazy today. Ronnie could be lazy today. I know he's always lazy, but you know, what can I say? <coughs> right? Yeah, I, I yeah, Nico. see, he totally agrees. Nico, <laughs> Nico. Is Papa always lazy? Huh? A lot of times. A lot of times? Yeah, I totally agree. After work, right? <coughs> yeah. He's always lazy. He's always lazy yeah, at he home? Always ask us. Yeah, have a, have a cold one with me. Mm. We're going to be slapping a few uh, steaks on the grill here in a little bit, right? Mm -hmm. Have a good supper. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. And tomorrow we're going to go on that bad boy over there. And we're going to do some fishing, right, Mr. Ronnie? Mm -hmm. That's a good idea, right? Mm -hmm. Are you going to catch the biggest one? Yeah. Yeah? Really? What, what am I supposed to do then? I can get fish. I can get the smaller one? No, not the small one. Not the small one? Oh, boy. Okay. And last time when we went fishing with, with our guests, then we, we got a lot of fish, but then, like, like, with like not with this boat, but like at Batula Lake, I think it was. Yeah. Like, we had like that thing like you know like that has you can put your fish on. Yeah. It broke off. It broke off? Yeah. You had that many fish? We have nine or ten on. <gasps> wow, that should be a nice fry, eh? Fish fry, eh? They went to the engine on like on like the boat and then it and then they and then they broke it off. Oh my goodness, hope that doesn't happen tomorrow, right? I, my dad told me to pull really hard and I did. Oh but you then did? Really Your dad's strong? Two there. Oh my. Tomorrow we we're gonna put him in the fish box, right? Mm -hmm. and yeah. Then, and then afterwards we got lots, more than ten. Oh that's good. So at least you had a nice fish fry. I think that's what we're hoping for tomorrow too. We got us a nice fish fry. Having a good beer. Mmm. Uh, yeah, anyways, let's get a few steaks on the grill here and uh, get our barbecue going. What do you say, Mr. Nico? Time to check on the meat? Mm -hmm. Show everybody what we got on the grill? Yeah. I think so, too. What do you say? You want to open up the grill? You want to have the honor? Show everybody? Yeah, well, it's not hot at all. Not hot at all. Whoa, look at that, eh? Holy moly. We got the whole rack full over here, eh? Ronnie might have to get some water over here pretty soon. He's got a fire going here. I don't know. Oh my that burn. Yeah, that one is going to burn if we don't take care of it, right? Yeah, I think so too. We better close this, Neen. Yeah, yeah, close it. Yeah, just close it, right? Yeah, you have a double meat on it. Yeah, that's okay. I'm the cook today, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the one that almost burnt he put on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to give that one to Ronnie, right? Later, if that's burned. <laughs> uh, I, I totally agree. <laughs> <laughs> I want to have a black hair. Yeah, yeah, he wants to have black hair. What, you want to become black? Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're having a good time, right, Nico? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I totally agree. Yeah, it's going to be good supper, eh? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, yeah. All right, guys, it is time to check on the meat. I think it's uh, just about done. What do you think there, Mr. Mm -hmm. Ronnie? Does it smell like it's almost done? I'm really hungry. You're really hungry? Well, I don't care about that. Yeah, you... You should? Yeah. yeah, I should. All right. Yeah. Well, then I better check on this. Huh? I think this is looking pretty good. What do you guys think? My opinion, this looks just fine. Ready to go, right, Ronnie? Yeah, it's uh, uh, very good, half eh? Half hour to go already. Half hour to go already? All right. All right. Well, let's get our plates and uh, let's have supper. And I'm cooking tonight, right? Because Ronnie is... You now, he worked all day, right?